Talking with Stock Babies, a gaming show for the average Joe and far beyond. Far beyond, beyond the stars, and maybe some dogs as well, because a dog named Winter has like no, right here next to us, who is, oh, she's, she's so far away. she's a goo goo, you know. We got this dog from Tim, the outer specimen, from outer space, because he saw some signals from Pluto, wanted to investigate, he said, hey bro, can you look around my dog? And Tim never came back. Yeah. Last week, we supposed to come back. Well, I don't really know how space travel. How long does it take to go to Jupiter? Um, like 25 hours. Like well, then, of course, not worry about it. Well, well then, yeah, I, he'll come back. Yeah, yeah Tim will come yeah, back. Tim, Tim will come back. We're flipping the script today. This is a very special episode of Stock Babies, where we're doing our year-end review, where we break down every system and what they did this year, their ups, their downs, and all everything in between. Now you know what it is. First of all, we have the Mayweather of the systems out. The PS4, also known as Harley Super 4. <laughs> well, the PS3 was called the Phantom Space Time whatever. I don't know what it's called. But anyway, after that, we got the underdog for a reason. The Xbox One. Just like its previous system, the 360 would went to one, and the original Xbox One, which is the first one, proving once again that Xbox can't count the two. Last but definitely not least is the Nintendo Switch, the hottest selling uh, tech around, or what I like to call, what the Wii U should have been. It's super hot. Anyway, I'm the Gutter Cat. And I'm the Lo-Fi Beatnik. And this is Stock Baby's Year End Review. We're starting off this conversation with the PlayStation 4. This year it had a lot of ups. So many ups, it's like an old man with Viagra. Mm. Very, 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 very stiff. Very stiff competition. Very stiff competition, but I think the PS4 was the stiffest one of all, the, all of them. It's like they're racing with that uh, stiffness, if you would say. Speaking of which, let's break down what the system actually has itself. For one, we have updates left and right. Some a little bit weaker than the previous ones, but that's optimization problems. But besides all that, it supports, and I kid you not, something that everybody been wanting for the longest time, they support hard drives. Ah, uh, finally, damn. I mean, like, you know, I, I have an older model PlayStation 4. You know, my memory runs out like crazy. Like a fiend. Like, like I mean, like, damn, I mean, 500 gig, that's nothing, you know? Oh, I'm feeling the pains myself, man. I know what you mean. I mean, like, good thing, good thing, being able to put like expendable hard drives now, and I have a lot of them. I have a lot of them just laying around. Actually, I don't, but I do. Yeah, I just, I, I just messed up on that guy. Well, I mean, I mean, it's messed up, but it's a good thing now. You know, that's, that's you know, that, that's a good thing about it. Anything else happened this year for this for Mr. PlayStation? Oh, they still have updates, man. They updated like things. I mean, for one, they had a, a, a faster mode for the PS4 that just makes games. Uh, just run better, looks nicer. You know, almost everything at 60 frames, quink, quink. This is no this is on the PlayStation <laughs> Pro, right? The PlayStation, PlayStation Pro, Pro, exactly. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So you know, uh, yeah. Well, the PlayStation 4 Pro uh, was released late last year, right? Uh, and yes, it was. Remember correctly? Yeah. So I would imagine all these updates uh, gave most of its games kind of like a nice, you know. Update. Faster frame rates, nice frame resolution, rates, make it look nice and all that. probably less glitches, and they'll probably dispense popcorn eventually, but they're beta maxing that. Oh, yeah. And not beta testing, beta maxing because you're using tapes to tape up all the conversations. Anyway, besides that, I, they're going to finally, or they might not actually, have something that the Xbox had since the dawn of the first Xbox. That ah. went to the second Xbox One, then the third Xbox One. Oh my god, I know what it is. What is it? It's backwards compatibility. No, but speaking of that, it does have the PS2s. More PS2 games are coming to the PS4. But also, I'm trying to talk about though, is gamer tag changes. Because we all, and we kind of admit this, we all have some stupid names. I know uh, I did for the Xbox. Uh, I've been a PlayStation loyalist for a long time. You know, my PlayStation name is still back then from PS. Kevin! PS3. PS3. But Lord! It's not Kevin. Robert! It's not Kevin. Robert. Captain Toast Chew! <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, uh, you know, that, that sounds great for next year and all. I mean, like, but we heard this conversation before. Yeah. You know, they've been, they've been kind of like hinting this for a while. But, but the thing is, now they're actually going with it. I mean, it's not like they're uh, at least trying to get um, crossplay, which they still don't have. But the fact that they're actually thinking about it, and I know there's a possibility. If the Xbox can do it, these guys can do it too. I mean, just a matter of switching about oh, yeah. a couple I mean, of things. The, the, you know, there's probably little things here and there. You know, it's, it's probably... But, you know, it is. speaking of, um, of things they're doing right now, and, and 
I guess charging, I guess, if you want to jump into that. The PS4 is now having a $10 increase. And to my, like for a, a PlayStation Plus for the whole year. But the thing is, the Xbox had it for the longest time, yet Sony was the first one to, uh, when they introduced it, they also gave free games with that, which I thought, wow, so you're telling me for 50 bucks, I get uh, online and free games? Well, that's pretty cool. Right. I mean, let's face it though. It, it makes sense, with current economy and all that. No, I, I mean, mean, like, it, I, mean, I don't like, mind the 10 bucks at all. It, it's exactly, it's, it, it's not They're exactly. probably gonna, but with the extra money they'll have, with that extra revenue, they'll probably improve um, the online capabilities anyway. So, I, I, you know, I wouldn't say I totally applaud them for us a, a, a spike because I have to pay more. But I understand fully, and I don't hate them for it. In fact, hey, it's the business world. What do you expect? Yeah, exactly. You know, um, honestly, you know, let's talk about those backwards compatibilities. I, yeah. I mean, like, I get that we don't have a lot of the older games in it, but this year was actually really good for games for PlayStation in general, right? Yeah, oh, games in general for PlayStation is... Well, well put it this way. If you had a genre, odds are there's three games that match that genre. At least. At least. Oh, goddamn. No, I mean, we had a... Um, What's that game? Uh, that one with the fighting our uh, robot lady. <laughs> oh, okay, so yeah, that's um, near Automata. Near, uh, yeah, near Automata. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Wasn't that a sequel to a game? Yeah, or? actually, it was. Se it's like a pseudo sequel, I guess. Pseudo sequel. Like it's like in the same world and all that stuff, hmm. but this one it's kind of like. You're like robot people. It's, it's, it's like game was critically thing. Robot people. You know, the, the PlayStation had no shortage of of, short, of good games this year. Oh, what was that other sweet game that reminded me of uh, uh, Onimusha? Ah, oh, that's a uh, Neo. That's that game is the closest thing you'll probably get to Onimusha. Oh, it's a little bit of a Dark Souls flair to it. Do you hear us, Capcom? Release the HD collection already. Got. Gosh, yeah, darn it. a new one. They, the, yeah, give me a new Onimusha. Oh, that'll be sweet. Imagine. From the, the, the time of the Japan and in the time of now, Liam Neeson and <laughs> he's got it would be Liam Neeson. And he's like, I got, got I gotta fight. He was like it's demons. Nineties. Liam Neeson. Prepare to taste the, the wrath of the Lord. <laughs> Liam Neeson. No, they wouldn't have Liam Neeson nowadays. We have Liam Neeson from the movie um, Gangs of New York. Right before he gets killed, bam, they take him away so he doesn't get killed, and he's fighting evil demons in Japan. That would be a sweet Pony Mosha game. That sounds a little sick as Right? <laughs> um, this year also saw um, the release of one of their biggest games in years, mm -hmm. Horizon Zero Dawn. Oh my god. For Oh my god. Yes. That's yeah. a clean looking game. Who are they made by again? Uh, Gorilla Games. Killzone guys. The Killzone guys. The exactly. Killzone guys. The guys who made Nazis in Space. Nazis in Space! Actually created a <laughs> game that's a lot more coherent, a lot more... It's beautiful, I guess you could say. You're fighting ro big ass robotic dinosaurs, hunting style. You're, and you just go in there and it's time. It's, it's, just think about all those words put together. That's you know. Yeah, and the, you. Some of you might be thinking uh, the Monster Hunter theme, but I'm thinking. Da, 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 Jurassic Park. Welcome to Cannabis Park. This little shout out to the Owl House. Fuck y'all. Yeah. Anyway, besides that, you know, PlayStation had so many other games, things like Persona 5, which was good RPG. Um, Probably RPG of the year, right? Or almost game of the year. Almost game it of the year. It was actually nominated along with Horizon Zero Dawn. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, like, again, it was a very good year for PlayStation when it came to games. They, all, they, also, they also did a little bit of work with their VR system. Uh, again, like every second secondary um, PlayStation system, you can't, you know, don't expect too much, but it's, it's good that they're nodding towards it at least. Well, the good thing about it is you're having legit support, especially from Bethesda, because you have Doom, you got uh, Skyrim, Scream! you got Fallout. I mean, if you would, and, I, and guys, if you're listening to us, trust me, if you're listening to us, imagine Oblivion Online VR, and a Doc Hack guy's coming. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That'd be great. I know, right? A new Dark Hat game? We have to stop the Dark Elves and Dak and Dak and... I know, right? Jesus, I don't know, man. I mean, like... Or so, Virtual Cup. So, like I said, <laughs> not much else in the, in the way of... Besides games. I mean, games are games. I mean, games are games. That, I mean, that's all they need. Give them the games. That's all they needed this year. Do you tell me that a video game system needs video games? Yes. Oh. You know? Wow. Unlike a certain other video game system that we're about to get into right now, but... You're you know, talking about the... the, the, the Someone who can't count to two. Yes, the uh, fellows who can't count to two. Mm -hmm. yeah. But you know they can't count to two, and but what what did they have in stock right here? Well, they can't count to two, but 
you know, they take the Capcom approach and they go up to X. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, when you, when you think the Capcom approach, you gotta think back then, you know, Man Man 1 through 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, X. X! <laughs> and then 7. Okay. Then they just skip, they just skip uh, 2 through 6, but, you know, uh, 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 more or Alright, so let me guess. So it's like, phase 1, video game. Phase 2, phase 3, X. Yes, more or less. So anyway, Shout out to the, the, like, what, what, what we're talking about is the release of the Xbox One X. X One X. The the strongest system ever created. If you're not a PC fan. I swear to God, if you don't like PC, host. Anyway, this is the actual, and I kid you not, this is the first system with liquid cooling. That's how strong it is. Yeah. Yeah, and I know. Think about that. Explain to people what liquid cooling. Is. Liquid cooling is when liquid goes to the chips in a certain way and cools it down that way because um, fans are not uh, capable of cooling it down into the, the same amount of thickness. But the thing is, I'm curious what happens if you pick it up and start shaking it like uh, like someone. Well, I heard that. <laughs> I, th I think if I'm not mistaken, when it's not on, yeah. it turns sort of solid. So it's not, uh, so it's not. It's so it turns a gel? Yeah, it's like a jelly. Wow. So, uh, okay, yeah. that's really that's cool. advanced. That's, actually, that's really uh, innovative. And anyway, it's like oh, that's both extra this, power. This, I forgot yes, what to do. The system boasts 4K and HDR visuals. Wow. Which, uh, uh pretty, pretty, pretty. I gotta admit, it's amazing. Man. Well, yeah, I remember seeing a, a screenshot of Oblivion when it was on a 360 compared to Xbox One with the boost up uh, <laughs> textures. And I know it's not the, the mod pack, but. Those textures looking, oh my god, I got, I fell in love with Oblivion again. Elder Scrolls of Oblivion. That game would yeah. look great with that uh, update. Alright, imagine, right? But, yeah. but they have released updates for games like Gears of War. And if you're into fantasy stuff like that, they release also games for, for Witcher. Oh, so Witcher 3, so you know, if you ever want to jump back in there, imagine that shit with 60 frame, 4K visuals, you know, all that good stuff. And popcorn at the Spences on the side. Alright, uh, but you know, like every ups, there are some downs. You know, um... I mean, yes, they took a shot instead of taking the, pill, uh, the gaming Viagra pill. Well, yeah, essentially. Pretty mm -hmm. much the, the gaming landscape was barren this year for Xbox. I mean, like, you know, I mean, all uh, the... announcing all the stuff for Xbox X, that's, that's beautiful. I mean, the game, like I said, you can't knock it, it's a beautiful system. We need games for it. Yeah, exactly. We I mean, you could name the games already. Of course, they have all the third-party support that the PS3 oh, yeah, had. Of course, you but know, I mean, but the thing is, that you got to remember, some games need to be anymore. optimized. Yeah, true which that. not all of them are. Mm -hmm. But out of the games that are optimized, I mean, they just released Halo Wars 2 this year. So, you know, is it? Oh man, yeah. it, it's Command and Conquer Halo. Or, no, Command and Conquer Halo. Yeah, Command and Conquer Halo. You know, uh, Forza 7. For all you racing fans out For there. For all you racing fans out there, but like, let's face it, PlayStation released uh, freaking Gran Turismo this year as well. Yeah. Uh, and it flopped hard. Forza, New King, it's been New King for like the last ge console generation. I'm sorry, uh, Forza Gran Turismo fans. fans. Oh no, no, not Forza fans. Yeah, yeah exactly. Gran Turismo fans, I'm sorry about that. But, yeah. you know, Forza, you know, got you. And then, you know, with this Xbox X one, come on. It's just gonna make it better. I, I mean, I love the series, but we got it. When something better comes out, what can you do? Of course, they also released a uh, critically acclaimed Cuphead. That's an indie studio game that could. That was the one that did it. That did it? Yeah, you know, freaking great reviews. It was only like a 10 man team. Oh my god, yeah, I forgot about that game. That's the game that looks like a, a, a 50s cartoon, right? Yes, it looks like a 50s cartoon. Yeah, like, like Mickey Mouse just doing it, can't stop moving. He's like, I can't stop shaking. <laughs> And they made a game off of that, that's cool. Right? Yeah, and then, and then... Oh, that's about it. Well, except for one very, 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 very popular game. Mm -hmm. uh, you may call it Pubs, but it's really called PUBG. I call it what I want to call it because I call anything how I call it. <laughs> there are no battlegrounds. The one of the most addictive, freaking psychotic shooting games out there right now, apparently. Full of bugs and glitches, but who the fuck cares? The game is you amazing. play Minecraft, why are you crying? I, I, I do not. Not play you, Minecraft. I'm addressing the. the Tim! <laughs> well, damn, Tim. I know you're listening. We have your goddamn dog, bro. Just come back. Come, back. come here to where's your ass like to know, she's Cambodia. Everything. She's, she's. Get off! Tim. Oh my god. Tim. Dude, she's gonna piss on my pog collections. You're gonna piss uh, on my no, no, no! Not on the elf pogs! No. Not on the elf pogs. How did you know I have an elf pog? Well, everybody has the elf pog, bro. Oh, god damn it. Alright, so anyway, aside from that, they, um, Xbox also purchased, um, what was that company called? Unfortunately, I can't come up with the name of that company because my notes seem to be off key. But, uh, they, they purchased a streaming company, which, um, 
which pretty much let them release their, their um, streaming company as well, um, kind of rival that of Twitch, you know, because the popularity of people streaming is big, but let's face it, you can't be Twitch. Oh, wait a minute, I think I know what it's called. It's, uh, they purchased Beam. They, Beam the Beam, 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 yeah. Beam was Beam Yeah, and it turned to something new called Mixer. Ah, uh, that's right, yeah, Mixer. Yeah. Uh, again, it's not Twitch. Yeah. Twitch is like Facebook now. It is the Facebook it's the of Facebook the... Facebook of streaming. Exactly. You're not gonna be it. You're, you're not gonna be with the MySpace streaming. You're not yeah. gonna be with the title of the streaming. I'm sorry, title. I'm sorry, MySpace, Tom. <laughs> Tom, yours. Good guy. He always looked at the site, he's like, I don't wanna wear a better shirt. <laughs> uh, anyway, so, you know, they released that, but, you know, to uh, to the sound of a wet part, unfortunately. Yeah. And, I mean, like I said, it's too early. 2018 is coming up. Maybe they'll, I mean, they'll come up with something. Who knows? Maybe they'll bust it 360 and not count the two. Who knows? Nice. Alright, but you know, we can't, we can't, you know, oh, also, um, you know, Crackdown, Sea of Thieves, like a lot of these major games are pushed back to that to next year. No, I believe that Crackdown will be really useful for the, the, the 1X. Because... I believe Crackdown will be just okay, because Crackdown was always just okay. It sure. was pretty much Saints Row. Yeah, but better. Crackdown was okay. I'm not talking about Crackdown 1, I'm talking about Part 2. And if we're gonna compare it, Saints Row 1 was one of those games that was a clone of uh, oh, GTA. Yeah. We gotta admit that, but the thing is, GTA was always serious with a funny ass tone. Right? <laughs> anyway. Yeah, uh, so those were pushed back, and along with the cancellation of Scalebound, which looked like a fucking amazing movie. It looked awesome, dude. And then, plop! Well, uh, of course, you know. Who made it, though? Uh, I don't remember who did Scalebound. Was it the, one of the guys who did Devil May Cry? Yeah, it might have been. And here's one thing I never liked about uh, the one thing I never liked about uh, Scalebound. And I mean the one thing I don't like is headphones. Oh yeah, why kind of have that double make quite white hair and headphones? Look. I mean, why do you wear headphones and fight uh, dragons? Well, it's trying to let and you I'm know saying, that it's current time. Yo, I got these beats, and I'm gonna fight this dragon. That's why I got canceled. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Yeah. No, 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 uh, no. Again, no. again, we can't, we can't, but we can't talk about. We can't crap on Xbox all the time, this whole time because, um, you know, Xbox is still good. Yeah. Xbox is still a console. That's it's number two for a reason. It's number two. It's still loyal to its fans. And, and, but it's, you it's know, you know how, how, it, how it keeps itself relevant? By releasing things that, that people don't even think would, um, people would like. What? I'm talking to you, Sony exec guy, Jim, Jim Schubert. Jim Sterling? No, not Jim Sterling. Do I want to rant with the bat? No. With these rosy shades I want. Right? No, um, but um, Xbox is releasing tons and tons of backwards compatibility. The one thing PlayStation 4 has still lacked on uh, of doing. And this year they've also released the uh, backwards compatibility of OG Xbox games. <laughs> Xbox One games. You, you're telling me I can actually play Xbox One games on my Xbox One? Yes, Xbox One games on your Xbox One. So I can finally play Xbox One games on my Xbox One yes, while playing Xbox One. Yes, that means Turok Evolution. Tur oh, wait, 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 what? That means Turok Evolution. Oh, snap, I didn't think about that. Right? Holy crap, I haven't played Turok in a while. Too? Oh my oh. god, Lemmings. 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 Bomberman X0. Bomberman! That was 360. And it'll probably come out, come out even. It probably will. The first game to feel like a PC game on a console. Yeah, you hear that, Golden Eye? Here's a war on Xbox. One? No. It was a Xbox 360 game. exclusive. Uh, oh, God, yeah. um, these, these, generations, these generations, they blend. Well, I know. They, I still. They well, you can't blame on me. I still play uh, the Xbox version of Doom 3 when I don't. I can't. Oh. Dude, that was. Yeah, I know. I'm a demon, and I'm gonna cause some trouble. I will. <laughs> uh, 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 that 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 went south for the Also, they release EA Access, which lets you play a bunch of EA games for like thirty bucks a month. So you know, if, so you're, could, if you're an EA fan, would you, you know, say I could play uh, Battlefront Two? Yeah, you can play Battlefront Two. You could also pay for the loot boxes. Loot, loot boxes. Do you still have that? Yeah, I think that's a thing. Oh, that's that's well, fantastic. I love to be a stone trooper and say, wait, you can't defeat this rebel. Why? Because you have to pay more. <laughs> you gotta pay more. Rebel scum. <laughs> anyway, with all that happening, and they finally stopped Connect. 
Yeah. And that's all I'm thinking about. Top of that, or, or you know. Did you buy the eye toy? No. Did you buy Kinect? No. It makes sense because who wants to go? Hi. Wax on, wax off. It's it's like, like, you know, you know. I, I know that they stopped, you know, the the manual thing for the Kinect, but you know, let's just let's let something die. And they did. They did. It's a fun. And that was that was uh, that was Xbox's year in a nutshell. Yeah. And now we're going to talk about the handheld video game of the year. The PlayStation V. Oh, God damn it, dude. Yeah, let it go, dude. Let it go. It's, it's not no. going to happen. No. It's not going to happen anymore. I bought the damn thing. They, they it looks great. There was anymore. games. Oh, why, why not? They jumped, they, they jumped the VR, dude. Oh. They jumped the VR. Well, virtual reality is fantastic, but I want my portal. Well, where, where can I get my portable? Well, you can get your portable from the fellows at Nintendo with the Nintendo Switch. Are they going to go into my house and say we would like to play or anything like that? No, what? No. No? Because you're going to go to your own house, rooftop party, plop that motherfucker down, uh -huh. and pull off the two little the wiggly sticks off the fucking system. The wiggly sticks? <laughs> the wiggly sticks. The Nintendo wiggly sticks. <laughs> you know, you shake them, it feels like there's ice in there. That's, you wiggle. That, that, that's from that, from that thing where they did that, you know. Oh yeah, yeah, they're like... It's like, hey, look, look, there's ice in there. It feels like ice. They're like, it's ah. not cold. <laughs> you know there's one guy in Mark, he's like, look, Tim, 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 look, look. Because Tim does everything. Tim does everything. He do, he's an editor at Nintendo. And anyway, Tim, before, I mean, now he's an astronaut, of course, by the way. But anyway, Tim was hearing a conversation. He was like, hey, hey, look, look, I make this market about the Switch. And people are actually jacking off. See, I told you I can do it again with the Wii. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Reggie was right. Anyway. <laughs> so, the so, the so the Nintendo Switch came out this year to um, rave critical acclaims. I mean, that shit sold out real fast because Nintendo likes to artificially make shortages because we all know that's what you guys like to do. You know what that's like? They will come to your house and they want to play. Do they you will, watch they, your mouth. No, yes, I will, I will. Frankly, though, I, will. I still say that this is what the Wii U should have been. Yes, it's just, it, exactly. Uh, an actual handheld, not some tablet that you play with in the house. You can actually take this bitch outside, play it, plop it down. Like I said, at your rooftop parties. Rooftop parties. Because we all do rooftop parties. Rooftop parties. We all live in New York. We don't. Dude, we live in Chicago. All right, it's time for all y'all to know. We live in Chicago. I think about the buildings so I keep myself flaccid. <laughs> the Sears Tower, is that still a thing? Huh? Is that a thing? Yeah, it's, it's not, they're not like one day Chicago will be like, take it down. Take it all down. <laughs> it's not like Detroit. Yeah, become human. We're going to become human in Detroit? Oh, uh, uh, I get uh, it, because uh, there's robots. Uh, it's, a it, it's a video game. It's a video game, and it reminds me of one of the greatest movies ever. Because frankly, I don't like cops. Blade Runner. And cops don't like Final Fantasy. No, no, they don't. Have well, you actually seen a cop in Final Fantasy? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. He's like, freeze! Da -da 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 He's like, what are you doing? Oh, I'm doing a battle music, so if you whip something out, shoot you, and I'll go do 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 <laughs> oh, I got shot! We need a healer. That was 10 points. <laughs> it's like, I missed his head. 10, only 10 damage. Summon the SWAT. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> we need SWAT, we need SWAT. Shark. <laughs> do, 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 oh, do, do, do. No, it, it, it'd be more like, like, summon the SWAT. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh my god. That would be so. Range style. <laughs> Anyone listening who's an indie game creator, we would love either an RPG, a Doom style game, or what was the other one? Uh, wait, what are we talking about? If we're gonna make a game. Oh, and the beat em up. Oh, yes, it, yes. If you're gonna make a game about us, please let it be a beat em up. And please let us have all the revenue. Yes. We would love all the we revenue. We love all the revenues. Yeah, you can put your name on it, I guess, but that's pretty much it. You know. Do, 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 do. Rocket launcher tooth and they go, Rrrr. I know, like. Right? A little sweet to rage right there. Right? Oh, I love it. You press A by accident, you're like, fuck, and it's on shits. Oh. And you kill one guy. But, but, and it's not the guy with scissors. But this ain't Sega, we're talking about Nintendo. Nintendo? Yeah, we, we, we gotta get back on track on Alright, first of all, first of you, all know, you know, the only shooting you be doing well, on Nintendo Well, Nintendo don't play 16-bit games anymore, all they do they is don't. make modern HD games. Yeah, you know. But, you, you, they, oh yeah, no, there's no virtual console. Not yet, anyway. Wait, what? There's no virtual console yet. For real? Yes. 
So you tell me I can go to the rooftop party and not have Metroid? No, you can't have Metroid yet. Why would you buy another Metroid anyway? You buy it like eight times already. You know, I have a problem. It's a best spending problem. And I cannot, I cannot, I need help, but no one helps me. <laughs> I remember that one time you bought all those games. Okay. Oh, yeah. we don't talk about that. We do not talk about the, the Condor incident. Condor. Yes, Operation Condor, where we had a lot of Condors. Anyway, <laughs> Operation. Operation Condor! His oh. fight is one on one. Wait, was that a movie or something? Yes, that was, that was a movie called Black Eagle. I think you're freaking, he was totally not the main character of that movie. Oh. But the picture on the DVD said his fight is one on one. His fight is one on one. Because the main bad guy actually fought, no, the main good guy actually fought him, and it was a one on one fight. One on one. So that box wasn't telling lies. Yeah. yeah. Well, if you already think about it, eventually there's gonna be a scene where where one bad guy and one good guy will fight each other one on one. Eventually, you know. And that's an Arnold Schwarzenegger movie, which is seen, I got to kill everything. Yeah. And he just out an AK and shoots a thousand rounds with a with a ten mag clip. Oh my god. Hollywood. This, this, uh, I, I'm sorry, this is, this is pretty much how interested we are in the Switch. Uh, 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 I mean, uh, we don't have on the Switch. We don't have on the Switch. Bravo, yes. Bravo, Bravo Switch. Bravo, Bravo. Switch. We applaud your innovation. Non Bluetooth heavy device, but yeah. you know. Uh, you know, talk about Streets of Rage and Arnold Schwarzenegger is much much Because we love that. And let's, let's face it, if I'm going to shoot something, it's not going to be damn ink, okay? I'm not shooting the ink at anybody. I don't understand what you're talking about. Splatoon 2. Splatoon 2? Splatoon 2. Splatoon 2 the thinking of You know, the, the, the sequel of the critically acclaimed... Wait, was it critically acclaimed? I don't know. Well, oh, it's critically acclaimed for Nintendo games. But it's, it, it apparently... It was, it was, it was, the first Splatoon was on Wii U, which nobody thought. What's the Wii U? You know... The, 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 the Xbox One X. <laughs> that makes no sense. No, no. That, Gaming conventions. Gaming conventions. Naming conventions. Naming conventions. Yes. Naming? Yes. What I'm, what I'm, just, saying, what I'm just saying, what, I, what that means is pretty much like, naming. stop naming your shit stupidly. Oh, okay. Well, everyone knows how Nintendo actually does their thing, you know. Well, usually what they do, they go in a room in a circle. This is after the Wii success, of course. You know, they got the crystal. <laughs> They smash it. They smash it as possible. And I'm not trying to say everyone in Nintendo does crystal. They're just big fans of Breaking Bad. So anyway, they're breaking this blue stuff. They're snorting it. And one goes, and he passes out and he dies. And as a last tribute, they name it that. And then they stop doing crystal because let's face it, expensive now. And then they call it the Switch because the Switch in their ideas. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, they're now clean. They're all sober. Oh, yeah, you know, along with them switched ideas came the game of the year. Mm -hmm. On the Game Awards. What? Probably Game of the Year on a bunch of things. And Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Also known as Legend of Zelda. That's it. Legend of Zelda. Open world. For fuck's sake. Legend, Legend of Zelda. Monster hunting. Hunting monsters. Breaking weapons. After three hours. Yes. It's not bad. <laughs> it's a great game. Must motherfucking double uh, bats. Uh, also released were, uh, you know, <laughs> a couple of handful of games that came out on the Wii U. What? You know, like Mario Kart 8, yeah. you know, because you didn't play it on the Wii U. Boy, no. Uh, and, uh, <laughs> and uh, Pokemon, because you didn't play it on the Wii U. But what about that other silly-ass one that reminded me of Sock and Boppers? Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, and uh, another new IP from them, uh, ARMS, which is a... Uh, wait, 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 It's wait, called sorry. ARMS. It's called ARMS? Yes. Well, and not Soul ARMS? No, not Soul ARMS. No, that'd be stupid. It's not part of the Soul series. Okay, what about <laughs> Blades? Blades and ARMS? What did I just tell you? <laughs> <laughs> Think about this though, you know that game would be sweeter with blades, you know, and blood shoots everywhere. They, they, oh no, this is Nintendo, bro. They have blades. One of the characters like a ninja, his hands are blades, but guess what? what? Whenever you hit somebody, it just makes a sound. I thought they would sweat. No, it's Well, you should see their Mortal Kombat, I guess. So. Yeah, a, but anyway. No, but yeah, uh, so, you know, um, you know, for about a week, mm -hmm. people were like, oh, this, this is going to be the next big East. Game, sports game, oh my and then God. nobody believed that shit. Like, I remember that. Like, dude, think about this. It's a game where you get your little joy happy. What are they called again? Those little, little sticks? So they get the Nintendo Swizzle sticks, both of them, and you just whack each other retardedly, trying to whack each other, you know, whack each other on screen. And not knowing that, they can just go to the store, buy sock and boppers, and just go next door and beat the shit out of the, the neighbors. Taking their money, and you buy the crack. Let's go, dude. It's more fun than a pillow fight. Yes, it is. <laughs> but the Switch. They said it was going to be an eSports game? No, it's 
Nah, you know, people are like, oh, they're getting a hardcore fighting game, and then I like, can't. Yeah. Everybody on freaking Guilty Gear is freaking the most obscure freaking fighting game last ever. Well, because, you know, let, let's face it, that's gonna be an esport game. Like, all right. I can imagine this. Imagine like like like, like that that game, The Wizard, where this big opening screen happens. Some guy comes up. Welcome to the gaming ship awards. We have arms. We have contestant Billy, and other contestant Suzanne, the course, third. You know. Of course, all it took was like about a month before somebody found out that the ninja guy could just keep grabbing over and over again and not be stopped. Well, that seems like it's a broken game. <laughs> what? Are you, uh, Nintendo releasing a broken game? Gasp. You know, you're probably gonna get your ass beat it with that same dildo bat as Jim, Jim, yeah. Jim Sterling if some Nintendo fan's like, What? I gotta get this, I gotta write as much as possible. <laughs> Jim Sterling responds to this, let's see who, who actually wins in that. First of all, Jim Sterling, give me your fucking shades and we'll talk. Second, put your bat away. Yeah. Right? <laughs> Does he have a bat? Well, it's a. I hate to see it on the counter. We're not, we're, not, we're not gonna talk about Jim Sterling. But it's a purple dildo bat that he likes to whack around people, not his plane. We're not gonna talk about Jim Sterling. Yeah. Let's talk about Tom Sterling. Let's talk about Tom Sterling. Tom Sterling, Tom. 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 Till Dylan. Let me make it Tom die. Boy. Let me make it Tom die. Make it Tom die. I'm not talking about Major Tom. I'm talking about his son, Tom. Yeah. By the way, you know that Tom actually had a new son named Tom? Really? Yeah, his name's Tom. Tom. Yeah. Was that with that H or was that another one? No, it's Tom. Tom. Tom! I don't want you to have more sons. <laughs> Tom sounds like the name of a rabbit, which is the also a game that came out on Nintendo Switch. Wait, wait, what? You know, rabbits and more. Oh, Raven shoots and Raven and, 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 and yeah, Raven shoots and Yeah. 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 So that Woohoo! Be, uh... <laughs> anyway, not Nintendo in a nutshell. Good yeah. games, good system. That's all for Nintendo. It's Nintendo. Okay. Hey, here's the thing about Nintendo. They're gonna have some hardcore games, go figure, if you're third party, but in the end, if you look at the Wii, this is what the Switch is gonna be. Don't believe me? Look at the Wii U, you don't believe me again? What the hell's wrong with you? Well, like think said, about it, let's take a trend. Let's, let's recap this about a year or two from now, mm -hmm. and we're gonna be talking about the, the, the Wii U too, you know, because that's exactly what this is gonna be. Because remember when the Wii U released it, or, you know, people were like, oh my god. Selling hotcakes. You know, selling hotcakes. Well, not, not hotcakes, it's, it's, it's sold enough. Well, then, well, no, we'll talk about the, you know, the future Nintendo on our actually next show, mm -hmm. which will possibly be about the future of these consoles. Ooh. Right? We also got some more, and then we also got another big contender to talk about, but we're not going to be doing it on this show. Because, um, it's the biggest contender of all, and, you know, uh, it's the module. 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 You could say it's a okay. contender that, um, you trying to do the, what are you trying to do? Uh, I was just trying to run. Oh, spitly, diddly, chilly, billy, milly, find this little piece of hardware that you can build by yourself from the Master Races itself. Right? Praise Lord Gaben! Lord Gaben in his time! So, and that was our year-end review. I mean, like I said, there were a couple ups, downs for every system, you know. Um, you can't really say one really came up on top. Like I said, uh, uh, Nintendo, Nintendo did come out swinging, and that's good for them. But you know they're missing so many things, and it's kind of ridiculous, including some things like voice chat and Bluetooth. Bluetooth should have been uh, no great. It's portable. Bluetooth is on almost any electronic device. They should have added it. Period. Okay, Xbox is lack of lack of games. Yeah, go figure. Again, again, you know, it's not a lack of games. You know, what are you supposed to play on that thing? And PlayStation's lack of actual innovation. I mean, we love games, but come on, do something to make wow us in the way, yeah? Yeah, stop waiting for the time to do something for you to do it after. You know, and, you know that's you know that's our takes on these things. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, again, I'm the Gutter Cat. I'm the Lo-Fi Big Nick. You can follow me on Twitter at DJ Gutter Cat. You can also like and subscribe to our videos and hit that notification bell to understand when new episodes will be out. You know, and you know. Um, hopefully 2018 will be better for all these uh, systems, but you know, that's another talk for another time. Until then, we'll be seeing you guys. Alright, now anyway, the other day, I was with this, uh, well you could say it's a gypsy. <laughs> yeah. And then, he said he could shrink my head, and I was drunk enough to actually believe his shit. And I'm like, what do you mean by shrinking heads? And then he took my blood. 
Well, he, he chloroformed me, he took my blood. I thought he took something else, had the money, no. Apparently, he was misinformed that he could turn my blood to gold. Yeah, I know. Oh, shit. Dude, turn off, turn off, turn off, turn off, turn off, turn off, turn off.